new cervical artificial disc is the most amazing thing that's happened for neck surgery in decades. In Health Alert, how this new device is not only improving lives, it will potentially prevent future surgeries for those who get it. People, say I'm Caleb. 26-year-old John Scamahorn feared an auto crash last October would forever limit life with his son. And I was like, you know, am I going to be able to be the coach and play with my kid and play sports with him? He said, For months, his doctors tried to treat a bulging disc in his neck. The disc that is here has protruded, contacting the spinal cord. Putting direct pressure on nerves and causing extreme pain. 90% of the time, yeah, I was getting, my fingertips were still going numb. And I always felt like my arm was always aching. And Surgery I became the only solution, and for John, the timing was perfect. You. What you're going to do is remove the disc that's in this space and replace it with uh, this stainless steel implant. Which FDA approved this summer. Surgeon David Rubin says the Prestige artificial cervical disc is a huge improvement for patients. Though the standard fusion procedure is 95% effective, it causes stress on the adjacent discs. Ten years time, 30% of those of the people will have another surgery. But with this uh, procedure, with his uh, reestablishment of his normal motion, uh, that chance just isn't going to happen. And so. recovery improvements too. Eating solid foods in a few days instead of weeks. No neck brace necessary and back to work in two weeks instead of eight weeks or more. At day 10 for John. Now as far as I'm concerned, you're back to your pre-injury normal status. The FDA approval came after a study of over 500 patients comparing the artificial disc to fusion. And those patients did better, so it is a very convincing study. This is the most amazing procedure I've ever seen come around with the uh, results so dramatically, quickly appreciated. Uh, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a godsend. Patients like John agree. Yeah, now. One of the first in Kentuckyana to experience it, and that means his experiences with little Caleb will not be limited. But yeah, we get to play all the time now, and I can hold him without being in any pain. So I can look forward to playing sports with him, being his coach. If that's what it's now just over two weeks since John's surgery. He's back at work with heavy lifting, no restrictions. River City Orthopedic Surgeons is the first group in the area to implant the new disc. They perform the surgery at Norton Hospital, and patients leave the same or next day. Now, it is only approved for the replacement of one not more.